Now things are getting good. Uh, it's always a bummer to talk about backing up files, configuration, this, that, and the other, uh, PID tuning, uh, Expo, always a pain in the posterior, but OSD is always fun to play with. And let's see, this is my OSD Profile 1. This is my OSD Profile 2. It's got the warnings in it. If you look over here, the check boxes. And this is OSD Profile 3. And again, it has nothing in it. We'll put the video transmitter channel in it and see if that'll work. We'll click save on that change and then the, here's the exciting thing we're going to do. We're going to come in here and enable expert mode. We're going to go into adjustments. We're going to say that if on channel aux 3 which is where I had my beeper. For the full range of that channel, this is strange, stick with me, I want you to do OSD profile selection again based on AUX channel 3. We'll click save on that and then let's come out here and here's, I've got my hand on, oops, I'll put it in the camera on the drone if I can. <laughs> Here you go. Oh, uh, no, it's this one, isn't it? I uh, can't see that. Anyway, we'll flip it to the middle position. Uh, that's actually has warnings in it. There's no warnings, so you don't see any. I'll go to the third position. And there's your uh, representation of your band F channel 4, 25 milliwatt, I think. So now I have a switch on my uh, radio that will change between the three screens. I don't like that one. Let me go back here. And... Uh, OSD for my second one put something in there besides the low voltage uh, let's see <laughs> oh one of the ones I want to play with first up will be uh, stick overlay right this will be on two stick overlay right so that'll be the right stick overlay. Oops, boy. Okay, I can't put it all the way down there. I'll try to put it up here a little more. Oh man. Oh well. Softer always fights you. And then we'll put the left stick overlay right here. I'll show you what's going on with my sticks. I still need to change that expo again. Uh, next time I fly, I'm not going to fly tonight. It's 4:27 in the morning. There we go. Ah, I figured out how to cheat. See the little black box that comes up? I'm sure that's not what they did it for. But that's where the center's going to go. Okay, fine. We'll try right there. There we go. So that's, let me click save on that. And then profile three. I don't like that one. Um, get that one off of there and have it be. Ah. <sighs> I 
Yeah, just the artificial horizon alone. I wonder what artificial horizon sidebars are. Okay. We'll make it artificial horizon sidebars for three. We'll click save. 428. It says 425. Don't think that save worked. That's another thing you have to watch out with all these programs. Click save again. 428. 428. Yeah, that one worked. Now we can come back out here to our OSD and our switch. There's profile one, profile two. Oh, look. It shows my sticks. When I fly, what you're going to see is I'm doing like this for movement. Oops, that's not even going to be reflective. It's not going to reflect my stick movements. It's not sensitive enough, which is some of what I'm going to be talking. Well, this one will. So I'll just be going up and down on this one mostly. But this one, I'm still with my expo. I'm, I'm just barely moving the sticks. Anyway, and then the profile three, there's our horizon bars. So there you go. How about that for slick? I can switch between three OSD profiles with a switch on my radio in flight told you this was going to start getting exciting. Now what do I need to do? I need to go oops all save to file whoops I need to select it first don't I? Save to file go save to file and that needs to be my latest thing I'm working on and yeah now I can put that right back to this anytime I like again I just love it <laughs> click 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 three profiles I'll probably set one to nothing set one to minimum stuff and set one to lots of stuff all right. Like I say, things is getting exciting. Have a good one.